morning everybody. I am headed east to go do some work on a on my parents' house. I gotta re-roof her house and put a new deck on, fix some soffit. Hmm, fun things like that. I did end up staying outside of Pompey's Pillar. Last night I rolled in at probably one o'clock in the morning or so. I was planning on going to Pompey's Pillar this morning, but I did a little bit of research. And I don't think I really want to spend the time. It's it's really cool. There's a lot of history to it. William Clark and engraved his name on it in 1806, I believe, which is which is really interesting. But that would be the only reason why I want to go. I think right now I just want to get on the road and head east. Hopefully get to my destination before it gets too late. So here we go. This morning, it's 48 degrees, freezing cold. Well, I figured since I'm traveling through this, uh, the state I might as well take in the full beauty and splendor of everything that North Dakota has to offer so I present to you one of the biggest attractions in all of North Dakota ah North Dakota a state so boring that they have to put up a bunch of garbage on the side of the road just to hope that they'll keep you here for as long as you possibly can handle it. <laughs> I'm just kidding, it's actually pretty cool. I've never actually stopped to look at this and driving by it on the highway, it, uh, it doesn't look nearly as huge as it is. It's, it's pretty massive. Props to Whoever made this, this is a, it's a really impressive sculpture. I almost wish I can go and take a quick trip down and see the rest of the Enchanted Highway, as they call it. But I'm kind of in a rush to get over to Minnesota. <sighs> because it's been a long drive already, and I still have another 450 miles to go. Come on over to North Dakota, folks. We've got... Uh, We've got roads and rolling grasslands, a hay bale, even a tree or two. We got cows. We've got cows. Um, did I mention roads? We got roads, lots of roads. You're missing out. This is one of the hidden gem states of, uh, of the United States. We've also got plenty of 5G towers here in North Dakota. And you're gonna get great reception almost everywhere you go because there isn't a single mountain for 400 miles. Everything is flat. There's a turn coming up. 
Wow. This is exciting. Here it is, folks. See it? That? Oh my God. Look at that. It's a right turn. Wow.